Hey Gunners, how are you doing? How are you doing? Welcome back to the Arsenal show uh, here on Kosi Media. Manchester United fans, I hope you liked um, the update I gave you about uh, Jaden Sancho and, um, you know, uh, Sosha. I'll come back with um, other transfer news around United. But right now, uh, allow me focus on uh, Kia Jorab Chisun's um, uh, move uh, for William and um, uh, Felipe Coutinho uh, right now. Now, Kia Jorab uh, is... Um, the Brazilian agent uh, for two Brazilian um, players. The first one is Felipe Coutinho and the other is uh, William Borges da Silva. Both linked uh, to Arsenal, both very close to Arsenal, both uh, very, very good players admired by Mikel Ateta. Now, uh, it is um, a blessing in, in, in this guys. I would say that uh, the same agent for Felipe Coutinho is the same agent uh, for William and um, Actually, the same man is the same agent for uh, Joson Fernandez, the, uh, the, the the young playmaker or the young winger at um, you know a Sporting CP. Uh, he is the same agent as Gabriel Magales, right? Yeah, I think he's the same agent as Gabriel Magales. So you guys, you can see that you know connection as to why you know Arsenal is in that entanglement of um, you know uh, almost four players, but the, you know the agent is the same. And uh, Kia, uh, Kia Jorapchin is a very very good uh, friend of Raul Sanelli. Very good, uh, you know, friend of Raul Sanelli and Edu. And of course, you know the influence uh, Sanelli and Edu have on, um, you know, Arsenal. Uh, Sanelli is head of football and uh, Edu is, um, you know, sporting director at the club. Now, um, breaking news and uh, very good news from uh, from uh, uh, Kia say uh, uh, show that the deal for William is done and Felipe Coutinho deal is very, very close. Now, he was asked by Team Talk what, um, what the deal of William, you know, is about. Is the player going to sign for Arsenal? Is he going to stay at Chelsea? And um, uh, is, is, is Coutinho going to come to Arsenal? Is he going to stay at Barcelona? Uh, is he going to engineer a move for Coutinho to Liverpool? And all those other questions that he was asked in the interview uh, with Tim Talk. And he said, no, 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 no. Uh, William doesn't want to stay at Chelsea. That is what he said uh, in his own words. He says, William doesn't want to stay at Chelsea. And uh, he said that uh, he's having uh, negotiations uh, with another club, which could be very, very close to having uh, a deal done. That is, um, of course, uh, the only club in um, uh, in, in in talks with William is us uh, is Arsenal. Uh, the other club that was linked with uh, Lee, uh, William was um, uh, was Barcelona. But according to uh, Fabrizio Romano, he said no. Uh, there is no contact from Barcelona. They are just admirers. They are just monitoring the situation. They are looking at uh, William as um, a possible player. If he fails to go to Arsenal, if he fails to uh, agree a deal with Chelsea. Probably they can walk in and uh, get William, but uh, they are not actually in contact with Chelsea uh, or with uh, William uh, to sign him as, um, as, 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 a, as a free agent. Um, of course, the uh, player's agent has confirmed that uh, there is a deal that is very close to happening. Uh, we still wait for that you know, to, to, to happen because uh, you know, I'm really one of those people, and, and, and that's why on my uh, second channel I call myself the frustrated Ghana. Uh, I'm really tired of us you know, really signing players in you know verbally like you know I, I remember Arsenal tried to sign Karim Benzema if you guys still remember for a whole season uh, the same thing hap you know happened with uh, Gonzalo Higuain I think that you know by that time uh, as Asen Wenger was still manager um, you, you still remember um, Arsenal trying to find to sign Wayne Rooney for a whole season and uh, things never happened so I'm really tired of Arsenal signing up uh, you know players verbally but uh, you know at, at one point in time I would think um you know William Deal is really close. It is really close because when you look at all the elements, if you look at all the signs, if you look at all the things that are pointing to that deal, it seems Arsenal is going to make William uh, the first signing they are going to make. They are going to make. Uh, it's going to be uh, William. Now, still talking about uh, uh, Kia uh, Jorapchin and uh, his players, uh, he was talking about... Um, uh, Coutinho and he said that uh, uh, they are still working hard or he is still working hard uh, to see that his uh, how should I call it uh, client yeah uh, to see that uh, his client gets where to play from next season uh, we understand and um, he, you know he says this clearly that uh, he's not going to stay at Bayern Munich uh, for another season that is very clear and he also says the player is not going to stay at um, at Barcelona because there is no interest uh, from Barcelona uh, to keep uh, Felipe Coutinho next season. 
um, he says that uh, uh, there is a 10 million deal that could actually happen between Arsenal and um, and, and Barcelona. What is going to happen is this. And now Arsenal are not going to be paying um, are not going to be paying monthly or weekly wages to Felipe Coutinho. It's not going to be the deal. Uh, Arsenal are going to get 10 good million give it to uh, Barcelona and Barcelona are actually going to be paying uh, paying the full wages of Felipe Coutinho. Uh, that means that uh, uh, the 10 million will be used to meet half uh, of the wages of uh, Felipe Coutinho and of course other um, you know interest based uh, you know agreements that of course uh, will happen uh, between uh, Arsenal and, and Felipe Coutinho as well as uh, uh, Barcelona. So those are the two deals that Kia Raptin is working on uh, towards Arsenal, a very very big super Brazilian agent working with Brazilian talents so so much. The third uh, is uh, 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 Gabriel Magales. However, he didn't talk about Gabriel Magales. I want to make myself clear. He did not talk about Gabriel Magales. He talked about two players, Felipe Coutinho and William Borges da Silva. So uh, I want you to get me very, very uh, correctly. However, uh, that doesn't mean that uh, Arsenal is not linked with uh, uh, Gabriel Magales. Um, we are said to be in talks with Lille, according to Fabrizio Romano, the best journalist in the world of transfers. Go and follow him on Twitter. Uh, of course, for me, I don't have a, 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 a strong Twitter account and I even don't need one. Uh, but um, you, if you want to uh, uh, me on my social media, uh, it is YouTube and uh, Facebook. Uh, Facebook, I use the names of Cosma Sejirinha. Uh, you can also uh, find me on, um, on, 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 on a Facebook uh, page, Cosi Media Sports. Uh, there you can find me. But uh, basically... You guys, if, if we can be very, you know, realistic. This week, only this week, Sky Sports said we uh, tabled three, uh, you know, a three-year contract for William. Uh, he rejected talks with Chelsea for the first time. He rejected talks with Chelsea for the second time. And uh, I remember, uh, was it Henry Winter? I want to get my facts right. You know, one, you know, one of the transfer pundits around UK said, you know, whenever a player refuses a contract, he has an agreement with another club. Like, it is understandable. Oh my, what is done? I thought I had, you know, what I in there. So, that is, I think for me that is as easy as, you know, seeing the sun in the morning. Or as easy as noticing that, you know, the, there is no moon at night. So, uh, you know, Kia Jurapchin, uh, you know, I, I don't have, you know, big words to say about him, but, you know, I, I know uh, he's uh, a Brazilian agent, he works with Brazilian talents. Um, is he going to give us uh, William and Coutinho? Uh, I think it was yesterday when uh, news broke out that uh, we may either sign Coutinho or William, but not both. Uh, but um, it seems that, uh, that that update has been washed away uh, by the uh, new updates we have. It is uh, agreed that we are going to be uh, looking to bring in both signings. Uh, that is Filippo Coutinho uh, from um, Filippo Coutinho uh, from um, uh, Barcelona, and then uh, William Borges uh, da Silva on a free transfer. Two Brazilian talents, extremely talented, uh, for ten million, and then. Um, uh, we have to meet the wages of William as well. Uh, uh, we have tabled for him 130 grand a week. Yeah, that's good money. That's good money, William. Sign that, you know, uh, damn thing. However, uh, we are still linked. Uh, we are still first with a big problem. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang wants us to sign players, but he has not signed. Uh, we have tabled um, 300 grand a week uh, for Aubameyang, but I don't know if he's going to sign that, you know, uh, th that that thing. But, uh, you know, that that that, that, that thing. But um, Pierre. Alba, blood, clot, young, sign that thing, blood. Please do sign it. Anyway, um, I'm going to be signing out. Uh, I'll come back later. Uh, when I talk about um, the Manchester United update, of course, uh, I cannot... Uh, this is, um, you know, uh, like I said, United are the pioneers of this channel. Uh, they have done so much for me. I cannot really, uh, you know, just forget them. Uh, they have done so much for this channel. And I'm going to be coming back with uh, a big Manchester United, you know, uh, transfer update. Uh, thereafter, I'll, uh, uh, those will be... This is the... This is video number four. Uh, video number five will be a Manchester United video, and then video number six will be a general video. So, um, guys, catch me on the on that general video uh, when I talk about United and Arsenal, and then all the other transfer news around uh, um, 
the Premier League. Uh, congratulations, AK, uh, Nathan Aik or AK or AK, anything you want to call him. Yeah, he has sent for uh, Manchester City. He's lucky. Uh, I should say he's lucky. Um, you're relegated and then you sign for um, title challengers next season. Mm, that is good. Uh, but of course, uh, uh, City are doing well in the market, just like Chelsea. Uh, they have signed Ferran Torres as well. They have. Um, they, are, they are looking to sign uh, Kaludi Kulibali. So I think Chelsea are working. Uh, you know, uh, City are working hard. Chelsea, on the other hand, have, have brought in Ziek and um, Timo Vana, very close to uh, Kai Havertz. Why not? I think they are also working hard. And of course, as you know, uh, since we are looking at Abameyang and uh, William and Coutinho and Magales. And for me, like I said, if I can get Partey, get me Coutinho, William, and bring, you know Magales, make sure about you know Alba, 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 Clark, you know Young signs that you know team Arsenal will have the perfect perfect solutions to our problems. Okay, let me sign out. Uh, Manchester United fans, catch me later when I do talk about um, Jaden Sancho and his latest updates.